I got the game in a squeeze. Who disagree? I wanna see one of y'all run up a beat. Yeah, two open seats, we flying at seven and pep for the beach. Hey yo, hey yo, what is going on, guys? It's your boy Judge Flo Two, and you wanna be a speedster. You want to speak boost and take off on your defender. So today we are going to talk about it. As you guys can see on the screen, man, I am paid to say these things. If you guys want your badges grinded for you, make sure you hit up my boy Sports TMB. Once again, I am getting paid to say these things. <laughs> say what? Yo, those dudes are getting paid for this. Do not fall for this, guys. Now listen, I'm gonna keep it real. Yeah, Savage Jers up in the building. These dudes are getting paid to do this promotion. Listen, 2K19 is IP addressing blocking people. What that mean is your current PS4, if you get blocked from 2K19, you have to get a whole new PS4. Yes, it is that serious. The difference between 2K19 and any other game for like Call of Duty, for example. Call of Duty can have like multiple people playing in your account. 2K19, you actually win rewards in the end for like being top 99 you get these interviews you get sneakers immortalized uh on the next game you get invited to community like stuff like that you actually win so they don't want nobody but yourself grinding now this is a risk taker you know what i'm saying it's a risk taker take it at your own risk if you live in jersey for example and these guys are badge grinding from i don't know where they're from california they're gonna be like yo how did you get from jersey to california in 20 minutes and you're already playing the game like how do you explain that if you're a guy that just want to play 2k19 want to get some badges okay cool but if you're somebody like a youtuber that has a lot of subscribers or you're trying to hit top 99 you are going to be red flagged they're going to look at your things they want to know how you're getting so much rep, how you're doing this, this and that, such like, take it at your own risk. I'm just keeping it real, man, whether you like it or not. But without further ado, let's get straight into this video. Now, the reason why 76 is on the screen, because 76 plus 10 equals 86. Yes, I know my math. 86 equals speed boost, but there is a way to get around it without actually hitting your full takeover. Alright, so let me break it down, man, because I think people are getting confused. Now, if you look on the chart, right, this is the chart for builds that are eventually going to be speed boosting once they get an 86 ball control, which means that they are going to have that 86 ball control without being in takeover system. But your build can speed boost without being on this chart. For instance, I have a slasher slash shot curator 6.5. If we look on the chart, it says for that build, I got to be 5'7 to 6'1 to speed boost, but I'm doing it at 6'5. The reason why? Because my ball control is a 77. Once I'm in takeover, it applies 10, which pushes me over the boundary, which allows me to speed boost. Now, you also got to keep in mind, man, your build can speed boost without even being in takeover system. Takeover system pretty much is your player getting hot. You're starting to go crazy right now. You're doing a lot of dunks. You're doing a lot of shooting. You're doing a lot of mid-range. It's your player definitely getting hot. Fourth quarter, clutch time. Can't forget about the primary sharpshooters now. You're going to be able to speed boost, but you just got to wait until you're a 94 because that's when you activate your secondary takeover. So you guys just got to sit back and wait, but it's definitely going to be OP. Now, how to get takeover without getting takeover for my build, I've noticed that all it takes is two dunks or two mid-ranges, and it is over. My build is already going to be able to speed boost. But you also can stop that from taking a bad selection shot or getting a turnover. Takeover system, like I explained, is pretty much you and your player just getting hot. He's knocking down shots, dunks, mid-ranges, etc. He is on his game right now. But as soon as you take a bad selection shot, it goes down. So you can play it safe. If you do have takeover system, you do not have to waste it as soon as you get it. If you take smart shots with no takeover, your build can speed boost throughout the whole entire game until the end. Because we know when you activate takeover system, it is a bar. After that bar goes away, your build is no longer going to be able to speed boost. Then you got to wait, knock two dunks or two shots down then you're gonna be able to do it again now if you play smart 
you can just hold it down and speed boost and knocking crazy shots dunks throughout the whole game but it's a it's a gamble it's either you take a bad selection shot and you lose your takeover or you use your whole takeover doing those seconds and then you don't get it in the end so it's kind of a gamble you got to pick and choose when you want to use it if you guys get what i'm saying i just hope this helps and clears up some people that are questioning what is going on with speed boost and how does it work how are people speed boosting without even being in takeover system really quick i gotta give a big shout out to alpha gang if you want to be in my next video all you gotta do is hashtag alpha gang in the comments below and you'll get a chance just like these guys on the video for them niggas talking they don't want no smoke when i used to come around they play me for a joke now she want to suck and put my johnny in her throat if the shout out in the intros ain't enough we're also doing a giveaway for two winners for 35 thou in 2k19 so i know you want to buy some clothes you want to buy, you want to upgrade your player, dunks, whatever you want to do. It is for PS4 and Xbox. All you got to do is come right here and know you do not need Twitter. You're going to click this link and it's going to bring you right here. As you guys can see, free NBA 2K19 VC giveaway. All you got to do is do the things that they ask us. Subscribe here, subscribe to the second channel, then it unlocks 28 more things you can do so you can definitely win that vc we just gave away a free 2k19 giveaway so do not forget man i'm gonna be doing these giveaways a lot at random times so definitely come to the pack man you already know going super savage alpha gang that's pretty much it if you guys got more information write it down below alpha game make sure you guys also check into that giveaway uh, i'm not sure if i'm missing anything else uh, in terms of speed boosting you can do it at the rec center you can do it at events and park of course you can't do it in my court but other than that man these are just these quick tips maybe somebody didn't know anything maybe somebody picked up something that's all that matters i'm just trying to make these videos i know a lot of people have been asking like yo jers where you been at bro listen i've just been working a lot so I'm sacrificing some sleep just to make some videos for you guys and we will be going back to the regularly schedule and start streaming every single day plus I can't wait to show you guys my new build it is in the making it is something I'm completely new to we're gonna have fun for 2k19 don't worry guys I ain't going nowhere it's just slowed down a little bit because I have just so much going on right now especially with work but positive vibes up in the building it's your boy Jers man Hopefully I helped you guys out and I'm out here. Yeah. I style. No stylish. No Chanel, Nike track, doing pro with some wap and that's capo in the back and that's woe in the back. Don't need Gucci on my back. TV Gucci got my back. Don't know where y'all niggas at. I've been here.